black holes. The invisible wolverines are among the most mysterious and fascinating formations that we find in the gigantic expanses of the cosmos. Equipped with brute forces, the gravity of these mass monsters is so strong that nothing can escape them, not even light. In view of the enormous powers inherent in black holes, one might think that the gravity monsters embody something like cosmic destruction machines, but this is only partly true. It is considered certain that the bizarre formations adorn the centers of almost all galaxies and play a fundamental role in their development. Our domestic Milky Way is no exception. The hidden heart beating in the center of our home galaxy has the scientific name Sagittarius A star. In today's video, we reveal the research history of our black hole and how experts managed to capture the Colossus on film for the first time a few months ago. Want to learn more about the groundbreaking discoveries and the incomparable spectacles in the cosmos on a regular basis? Then remember to subscribe to Simply Space and click the bell to never miss one of our videos again. By giving us a thumbs up, you're motivating us and showing that we can keep you engaged with the content of our posts. Cosmic Omnivores No matter how deep we are in the matter, none of us can escape the laws of physics. Without us being aware of it, we encounter these fixed rules of the universe in all aspects of life. Whether animals, plants, or humans, everything we find on our blue home planet stands firmly on its surface. Accordingly, gravity on Earth causes all bodies to fall colloquially downward, more precisely towards the center of the Earth and not to drift off into space. In order to overcome the so-called escape velocity, and thus also the Earth's gravitational pull, we have to move at a speed of approximately seven miles per second. Now in the cosmos, however, there are also entities that never let anything escape once it has come under their grip, black holes. And by this, we really mean nothing. No information, no radiation, and certainly no matter can cross the event horizon of a black hole from the inside to the outside. What has fallen into the maw of these giants is irrevocably lost. Well, at least until we succeed in proving the existence of white holes, which could spit out the matter devoured by black holes at another place. But that is another subject. But what gives these colossi, which can exceed the mass of the sun by millions or even billions of times, their unmatched power? The characteristic abilities of black holes are due to their extreme compactness. A brief example, if one of these entities had the same mass as our sun, it would have an event horizon just 3.7 miles in diameter. By comparison, the actual diameter of our host star is an impressive 870,000 miles. We know from the comparatively small stellar black holes that they form when a star has reached the last stage of its life. As soon as the celestial body's own nuclear fuel dries up, it ejects its outer layers in an explosive supernova. As a result, the remaining stellar core collapses due to its own gravitational pressure into an incomparably compact object, the stellar black hole. However, how their significantly more massive counterparts are born remains a subject of research to this day. Given the terrifying forces inherent in black holes, one might think that we are dealing with cosmic killing machines. But this is only partly true. It's true that the gravity monsters destroy whole stars, planets, as well as gigantic gas and dust clouds. However, for this to happen, the objects in question must come dangerously close to the black hole's event horizon. Outside this death zone, the mass monster behaves like a completely ordinary body, which is why it can be orbited by other celestial bodies on stable paths without any problems. Speaking of the event horizon, seen from the outside, it appears like a black, opaque structure, with the surrounding space being grotesquely distorted by the gravitational lensing effect. As mentioned at the beginning of this article, it is now considered certain that supermassive black holes decorate the centers of galaxies and play a fundamental role in their evolution. How this influence is expressed in detail, however, remains to be found out in the future. Sagittarius A star. The year is 1932 when the American physicist Carl Jansky identifies an unusually strong radio source in the constellation Sagittarius. 
However, the true background of this ominous source was to be revealed only during years of observations that began in the 1990s. For the discovery of the supermassive black hole in the heart of the Milky Way, Andrea Ghez and Reinhard Genzel were ultimately to be awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics. In the meantime, we know that the hidden heart of the Milky Way exceeds the mass of the Sun by a factor of 4.1 million. Located about 26,000 light years from our blue home planet, Sagittarius A star has an event horizon diameter of 15 million miles. During the research, it became clear that some remarkable spectacles are taking place in the regions around the mass monster. Shortly after the turn of the millennium, experts tracked down the star S2, which is approaching Sagittarius A star on its journey through space to within 11 billion miles and at an orbital speed of up to 3,100 miles per second. A detailed analysis showed that S2 needs just 16.1 years to completely orbit the black hole. In the years that followed, countless other stars were to be identified in the realms of the mass monster. For example, S4716 chases around the black hole at an even faster pace than S2, covering almost 5,000 miles per second. But the so-called G objects are also moving back into the center of scientific interest. In 2011, the gas cloud G2 was added to the star charts. The structure of three times the mass of the Earth approached the black hole to within 15 billion miles, being pulled apart in a brute manner and shining brightly as a result of ultraviolet radiation from the surrounding star. Up to six of such G objects were found. But what we're really dealing with is still a mystery. The objects show some characteristics typical for gas and dust clouds. In the same breath, however, their dynamics are reminiscent of the behavior of stars. Physics Nobel laureate Andrea Ghez assumes this regarding that G objects embody double stars, which are about to merge with each other. While we talk a lot about the one black hole at the center of the Milky Way in today's post, let's not forget that Sagittarius A star is actually in great company. Analysis of brightness bursts revealed that there could be as many as 20,000 other black holes orbiting their supermassive counterpart within about 70 light years of the central structure. You could say the smaller black holes serve as cosmic waiters. According to this, the objects attract star clusters, which lead them on their journey through space straight into the maw of Sagittarius A star. Photographic Milestone in 2019, astronomers once again had the pleasure of celebrating a new milestone in space exploration. For the first time in history, experts had succeeded in capturing a black hole on image. This was thanks to the Event Horizon Telescope, a network of eight radio telescopes on four different continents. About three years after the first image of M87, which is about 55 million light years away, it was finally time for our black hole to present itself to the interested world. This pictorial milestone could be achieved by using the Event Horizon Telescope. Given the characteristics inherent in black holes, however, a key question arises. How does one photograph an object that is, in and of itself, invisible? As mentioned above, the gravity of the mass monsters is so enormous that not even light can escape from them. The solution? One does not capture the actual black hole on a picture, but its immediate surroundings. As a result, the invisible structure reveals itself in the form of a dark center surrounded by a luminous ring. But anyone who thinks that it was enough to simply press a shutter release button is way wrong. As part of a mammoth international project, the eight largest radio telescopes of our time were combined into a single camera. In the process, the complex technical equipment collected some three and a half petabytes of information roughly equivalent to 100 million TikTok clips. Furthermore, this gigantic amount of data was combined with special supercomputers to ultimately create a virtual telescope the diameter of the Earth. This has such an amazing sharpness of detail that it could even photograph an orange on the surface of the Moon from Earth. In this way, the black hole M87, or rather its immediate surroundings, could also be made visible. In detail, what is visible on the image as a dark center is the so-called shadow. This shadow is about twice as large as the actual event horizon. 
because the light is deflected around the monster in the center due to the extreme gravitational force, which allows us to marvel at both the front and the back of the structure. The glistening ring surrounding the shadow is in turn made of heated gas swirling around the gravity monster, the so-called accretion disk. In simple words, this is the cosmic buffet of Sagittarius A star. Accordingly, this disk-shaped area rotates incessantly around the black hole, steadily transporting matter toward the center. How far ahead Albert Einstein was of his time becomes clear if we consider that the observations of the scientists actually agree with the predictions of the general relativity theory. This is true for both the predicted distortion and the size of the surrounding ring. Now it's time for your opinion. What do you think about the irrepressible power inherent in black holes? And what are your thoughts on the first image of Sagittarius A star? As always, drop us your thoughts, suggestions, and feedback on today's video in the comments below. Are you in the mood for more exciting contributions on the topic of outer space? Then take a look at the other videos on our channel, which you can access by clicking on one of the images in the credits. Thanks for your interest, take care, and we'll see you next time.